How is it going everybody? You're watching Then About Tech and today I'm gonna teach you this. How to eject water from any iPhone. Just like the amazing feature we have on the Apple Watch, I'm gonna show you how you can do it on your iPhone. Let's get started. Okay, so there are actually two different methods for ejecting water from your iPhone. And in this video, I'm gonna show you both because you probably will need to do both methods if you wanna get 100% of the water out, all right? So, method number one is by using this shortcut right here called water eject is a very famous shortcut that you can download from shortcutsgallery.com so it's super safe all right and of course i'm gonna have a direct link to this page in the description down below so open it up and then you will open this page so you can go ahead and already tap on get shortcut one thing to keep in mind is that you will naturally need to have the shortcuts app on your iphone this is a native pre-installed apple application but sometimes some people delete it so just make sure you have it on your iphone if you don't just go ahead here open up the app store and do the usual so go to search and then go for shortcuts as you can see right here and then just go ahead and download it as you can see shortcuts made by apple and naturally it's 100 free all right so uh make sure you have it and then you can go ahead and get shortcut get water eject and then as you can see it will already open up the shortcuts app automatically it's gonna load and then just go ahead and add a shortcut as you can see and then it's gonna come right here so super super easy now let's go ahead and test it out. Let's put it to action and let me show you that it actually works and actually ejects water. All right, so let's get the iPhone and do what we want to do. Let's go ahead and put it in water, submerge it completely. It's perfect as you can see right here. The iPhone is inside completely submerged as you can see, but please don't try this at home. The idea here is for me to teach you how you can get rid of water, how you can eject water from your iPhone if you've had an accident. If you dropped your iPhone in water, uh, in a pool, in a lake, in the ocean, maybe in the toilet or under heavy, heavy rain. But of course, don't do this just for fun because you may actually void your warranty. As you know, Apple limited warranty does not cover liquid damage. All right. So just don't do it, all right? This is for accidents, of course. So, uh, as you can see right here, I've got me, uh, my iPhone is completely wet, and then the, the recommendation is you get a microfiber cloth, or any cloth you have available, pretty much, and then you dry your iPhone, completely dry it off, all right? Completely, completely dry it. And there's a special trick that you can do that will help you a lot as well, which is bump your iPhone, like tap your iPhone, on the microfiber cloth, like that, tap, 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 all right? I'm not gonna do it because I want it to be super wet so I can show you better in the video, right? But for you, of course, you go ahead and tap here so you get rid of the excess of water, all right? Now, let's go ahead and test it out. So let's go ahead and open up the shortcuts app. And first, we're gonna try method number one, as I said. So then tap on water eject, as you can see, and then the automation will start, tap on start, and then the intensity level, tap on three. Go ahead already for the maximum, all right? So tap on it. And then, as you can tell, it's vibrating here, right? So water is already coming out, it's vibrating. You can definitely tell, even though it's not a lot, as you can see, it doesn't eject a ton. That's why I said there are two methods and I'm gonna show you the second one right after. But you can definitely see it's vibrating, it's removing a little bit, so it's better than nothing, right? As you can see right here. So let it do its thing. It's gonna finish in just a few seconds. There you go, it's done. And another recommendation is while you do the water eject process, I'm gonna not allow, okay? Uh, while you do it, make sure your iPhone is facing down. Again, I left my iPhone facing up so you could see it, but again, facing down when you're doing it for real, all right? Okay, so now let's go for method number two, which in my opinion works even better. Of course, the idea is to use both, right? So go ahead and open Safari and go to this website from Tune Pocket. Of course, I'm gonna have a direct link in the description down below. Okay, so as you can see, water ejection sound tool, six sounds. So it's gonna give you much, much more to play with. It's gonna give you six different frequencies, which will help you out a ton. 
let me move it to the side so as you can see right here 65 hertz 100 hertz 150 and even more at the bottom all right so go ahead and play all of them i'm not gonna play all of them here in the video so it just doesn't get too long but you go ahead and play all of them and in my opinion the best one is the 150 hertz so let's play it uh let me go ahead and play it once again and so as you can see it's gonna give you that frequency and take a look at this let me see if i can get the perfect angle So, as you can see right here, take a look at this, it, it, it looks like everything is like vibrating here inside. Can you take a look? Yeah, like it's, it's much better, you know? Let me do it once again. So, as you can see, it's moving the whole thing. All speakers are moving, of course. It's gonna be very, very hard for you to take a look right here with these lightings but you can definitely tell here that everything is moving and is shaking and it is vibrating. And of course, the idea is that you do this facing down again, so it will remove all the water. So then you go ahead and you do it for all of them, all the frequencies right here. There are even more here at the bottom until you get your water be gone, as you can see. So it's gonna give you that effect as well. But in my opinion, those three ones the first ones are actually the best ones. So that's how you literally eject water from any iPhone, all right? It works on any iPhone, it's completely free, it's super easy to do, and it will help you so, so much if for some reason you have an accident, like I said, you drop it in water and so on, all right? So that's it, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next videos with you guys. Bye-bye.